I am Russell9d6, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Castle Progress. And it's a very good episode, or day to day, or technically like two or three days ago, but we reached 500 subscribers and I threw an underpearl. Not really sure if I meant to do that or not, but yeah. We got 500 subscribers, yay. Um. So yeah, well, I would have had this video out earlier, but uh, it was the last week of school, which means all of the finals and whatnot, and yeah, I was busy doing last minute study guides and projects that I procrastinated and didn't do earlier, so yeah, I didn't have time to really play any video games this past entire week. But now, school's out, summer vacation time and whatnot, so I should be able to have time to, like, regular, regularly, yeah, words, play Minecraft again, along with Dark Souls 2, because Dark Souls 2 is fun. Um, actually, as of recording this, I, if, I'm really close to finishing my first playthrough of Dark Souls 2, um, I'll talk about that later, and maybe in a Dark Souls 2 episode, instead of a Minecraft one. Um, but anyway, as far as a special go, or special goes, uh, yeah, let's go with that. Um, I thought about doing another time lapse, but when I looked into it again, the Camera Studio mod is still not up to date to Minecraft 1.7.9. It's up to date to Minecraft 1.7.2, but I didn't want to downgrade Minecraft in case it messed up the world, and I didn't really want to do another first-person time-lapse because, like, they're, they're hard to follow, because the camera's going every which direction all sped up, like, and it's kind of hard to tell what's going on. Um... But, well, while I'm talking about time lapses and whatnot, what I could also do to kind of avoid, um, relying on a, having a mod to record in third person would be to get a secondary Minecraft account and use my old laptop to play Minecraft, like using the, like, LAN feature, I could open this world up to my other computer, then I could play on, like I could build on my other computer while recording on this one. And I think I might eventually try to do that. I might try and like borrow a friend's Minecraft account first to test it out so I don't spend like 20 or 30-ish whatever Minecraft costs nowadays dollars on something that might not work. And then I could always like reuse that camera like in quotation camera account on my server also. Oh, and that is a very good segue, or it would have been a good segue if I didn't ruin it by interrupting the segue with saying it was a good segue. Um, but there will be an SMP episode out fairly soon when you guys are seeing this, and in that I will talk about having another contest to let more people onto the server. So yeah, look forward to that also. Um, anyway, instead of doing a time lapse, what I figured we would do today is have a fairly long episode and, like, finish this side building thing. And if you haven't already noticed, I built one segment of it over here, just so I had, like, the front part of it so I could build the front part of it without having to fill in the entire wall. Um, and then I also started outlining a tower over here as like a transition point between this part of it and then the front part of it. And I think I might actually quickly make that over here also. So center it there, do do do, do do do. And then go out one block for a base. Yep. Um, what else did I, what, yeah, what else did I want to talk about? Um, yeah, 500 subs. That's a lot more than I ever thought I would get, really. Because, 
Uh, that one black thick floor. Yeah, that's a lot. Well, I know in like the like in comparison to the internet, 500 people isn't all that much. Like in comparison, but it 500 still a lot of people to be watching me play Minecraft, which is crazy. And Dark Souls 2, I guess. I don't know. It'd be interesting to know, like, what percentages of people watch the different things. Um, something's not quite... Oh, wait, what? Oh, that's what it is. I don't know why I'm finding the center that way when I already have the center perfectly marked out. Right there. So, center. Looks good. <laughs> Okay, so, I'm thinking that we'll just have like a large archway and then maybe make a few large decorative doors to go, al go along with it, because I don't think a gate would really fit in this building. Then again, I don't even know what the building is yet, so yeah, there's that part. Is four blocks wide enough? Um, given the size of the building as a whole, I would say, yeah, four blocks wide is probably enough. Yep. So, one, two, three, one, is that four or three? I cannot tell. Yeah. Okay, that was four. Four, five, six, seven, and I'm going to go for a fairly tall doorway, I guess. I think seven might be too tall, though. We shall see. Um, that actually looks good. Okay, I'm not sure why I built the doorway first when we have other stuff to be building. Um, I know I want a tower here. I just don't know how I want it to look. Um,. And I said this in the last castle episode. Um, what I'm going to do for this top part is maybe like make some type of top part. Well, yeah. Um, make some type of like ending bit to top off the windows. Then have a little bit of a walkway. Then have another building on top of that. Here, there's a shiner up there. And it did not fall. Um, another idea I could, or another idea I could do is just have it, like, go out, like, one block, then continue up and have another set of windows, and then another thing on top of that, uh, that. Um, I think I'm gonna go mess around in my creative world a little bit to get an idea of what to do, then we'll build whatever I end up building in this world, and I will be right back. Okay, I spent a... Mu well, yeah, a much longer amount of time than I thought I was going to do, or I thought I was going to in my creative world, but I have, uh, like, got a very nice, cool-looking concept going, so, um, it's probably going to end up being one of the most complicated structures I've ever made, but... I would say working, like, transferring it to this world is definitely worth it. Um, but because of, because of how complicated it is, we might have to end up taking quite a few, um, uh, like, cuts for me to go and look at it again to refresh my memory of how it goes. But I do have a screenshot which should be enough for me to get this entire first part done. And I almost messed it up, messed it up right off the bat. Okay, so the sen it is centered on this part. So
let's yeah what I'm doing right now is just making an outline of the entire thing so it's easier to make as we go um that looks correct I want to say so yeah let's just get going and build stuff that's what we do okay um but I haven't made the bottom portion of it yet so we'll be starting up here which is kind of meh but yeah oh we'll work with it okay then what I did it's a continual stone pillar up the entire this part but it's in seven block segments basically in the same concept as those towers only different and cooler and whatnot so let's go up seven blocks one two three four five six seven then we'll be doing stuff above and below it but that is not our priority at this specific moment okay then that is not how it goes I believe I'm looking okay I was kind of close with that um it goes like this instead not, not like that at all whoops um actually we don't really need to place that one because it's a solid pillar of stone bricks on that part and I believe that that is the end of the seven so another bit like that goes there and I'm not really sure how tall the tower will end up being at this point but we will just end it off sometime sooner or later and yeah um, let's just keep building it for now yeah I am doing this correct I believe I hope uh, confidence anyway this goes up like that I missed the block that goes like that and that like that and then uh, that's like th that and another pillar of stone bricks and if you're wondering why I'm using the cobblestone walls instead of just cobblestone I think it looks better for this because it adds a lot more depth which we don't really need to add on the larger towers because they're larger so yeah that's why I'm using the walls instead of four blocks okay I'm just gonna build a small segment of this for you guys to see then I'll finish up building it then we'll start working back on the main part of the building no that's not right yeah. Is that right? Okay. And that continues like that. And my uh, zip, not like that. And one block down. I yep. Okay. Progress. And we could probably just do that also right now. Um, let's jump down on this side stone bricks okay um okay that is right but yeah um as i said earlier this is probably one of the most complicated build or is going to be one of the most complicated buildings i've ever made and yeah it's going it's going to look really cool in this area Okay, I think that should be enough of the tower for you guys to get a feel of it. Not real. Oh, and we missed the block up there. Um, but yeah, you can kind of start your. S yeah, talking. Um, it's starting to take shape, so what I'm going to do is I am going to build the tower all the way around because. Actually, I don't need to on this part. Um. Oh, and since we moved it out one block, this would 
get moved over one block also but we're not going to work on that part right now so I am going to build the rest of the uh, the tower and I might go up one more layer because we are building up and I'll be back after I do that okay I have two sections or layers rather of the tower made okay um Instead of continuing with the parts I've already planned out, I think we should actually finish the base of the tower. Because we'll have to do that sooner or later, anyway. Um, it's a lot of space to fill. Okay, let's, first of all, let's get a height advantage. And I'm thinking that something like this would end up looking fairly good. Actually, how many spaces is it between it and the very bottom? If it's seven, that would work out perfectly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um. Because it's already wide enough, I don't think it really needs a uh, like width change for the bottom part. So let's actually see what it looks like. Oop. Uh, throwing every everything everywhere. Now let's actually see what it looks like if we just continued it downward. Because I think that might end up looking good enough on its own. And take down the dirt. Okay. Stone goes down into that little cranny, or nook, whatever it would actually be called, I do not know. Stone bricks, okay, one, two, three, four, five, that would be there. And I cannot pick up the cobblestone, let's actually put some of this in our supply chest, which is basically our... I don't need this right now, let's put it in here, chest. Nope, and that is the wrong type of block. Okay, almost done with one side of it. Um, yeah, I think this should do fine. We might want to do a little bit of stuff on the bottom though, just to kind of give it a different base instead of just repeating the same pattern across the entire thing. Let's just quickly do this first. And one there, just for safe measures, or... Yeah, just to fill in all the empty spaces, because, yeah, might as well. Um, and we don't, won't actually need to fill in this stuff, because it will go into the wall, so... I would say that is good for that part now, and I still need to put all the windows in. Well, actually, what I might do for this bottom part, instead of windows, is use more cobblestone walls to kind of just fill it in. And I'm thinking that this would probably be enough for making it more of a base, I guess. Good enough, I guess. Actually, now that I look at it, it might look a little bit, might look cool if we raised this up to be the center, well, almost the center of the window. Yep, oh, that is dirt. And that should be there. Okay. How does that look? Um, I think that looks really... I think that looks good. Okay. Now we start getting into the complicated part. Well, let's actually do the same thing on this side also, just so it's done. Okay. Um, I'm not really sure how to properly, like... 
like explain this complicated part aside from it's complicated yeah okay first of all it gets real complicated because now I think this is going to look really cool in the end and that's why I did that spacing I'll have to do something different for the doorway but I am going to curve the building in to leave an opening between the tower and the um what's it called this part so I was about to build it down there but that would be wrong uh, but there's going to be an opening between the windows up on this part and here so like the tower will be separate from the main building which I'm think it's going it, well I know it looks really cool because I built it already that's not where that stair goes my stair um anyway but before we get to that we need to make the second tier because the first tier of windows is built into the tower the second one is separated and to do that we need a stair there only can't really place it there we go okay and also I have netherrack and, and a flint and steel because we're going to do some fun torches. Okay. This part. Um, let's actually build up two segments at a, well not two segments, but two half segments to make a whole segment at a time because it would make it much easier for me to comprehend what I'm doing and I hate rain so much. In fact, I am going to go sleep and get rid of this rain. Okay, the rain is gone and everything is good. <laughs> oh. Anyway, as we're building this, I guess I might as well talk about like what this building actually is going to be, which is a good question because I do not really know. All I know is it's going to end up looking really fancy which is good and it's by the stables so what I'm thinking it what might be a logical thing for it to be would be like a lord's chamber or something like that like not full royalty but kinda partial royalty and we're not just doing simple torches also well yeah not, not, not the smoothest transition right there but good enough we're not doing simple tra uh, talking. The torch is gonna be complicated. <laughs> uh, because we're making them all 3D ish, even. And this might be a little bit too much for a realistic aspect, but I think I kind of gave up on the entire keeping it realistic aspect kind of thing. Because it's beyond realistic because the towers are like 70 meters. Well, I don't even really know at this point. The walls are 40 meters tall. Well, 40 blocks tall, which is... I think I read somewhere that a block is equivalent to a meter. And a 40 meter tall wall is not realistic in the least bit. So we're just going to make stuff that looks cool. Like, we're not going to make anything ridiculous, though. Like, completely out there. But, yeah, what I did just there, without really talking about it at all, like I should have been doing, was making the window sill for the next window tier. And if you notice, it's in between the two windows already on the bottom tier. Let's actually light the... Oh god, we're on five. Yeah. Those diamond boots might break if I'm not careful. Okay, um, we have ender pearls, so let's just jump down here to look at it quickly. Can't really tell what it looks like from the ground, so... Really, another lighting glitch over there. What's up with all the lighting glitches? Because as soon as I get close to them, they update and then they disappear. Like, see? Which is a pain, because... If I ever want to take a full screenshot of the castle, I have to go to the lighting glitches to get rid of them. 
and go to the screenshot <laughs> pillars and then take the screenshot and if I die I have to reset them anyway you can kinda see how the torch is kinda three-dimensional and I think it looks really cool like that I'm really glad at or yeah I'm glad at how it turned out so now let's get up there by throwing an ender pearl into the pit of fire success um anyway um another well one of the things I wasn't quite sure about when making the design in the other world was how tall I want these second tier windows at first I had them five blocks tall because it is above the other tier but it's the same exact window design arch like even has the redstone lamp on the top and it looks a little bit too short at only being five so and we have room to work with so I think we're gonna go the full seven I lost count because I was talking, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yay, we did it right. Anyway, oh, does it have to be there? I did that on purpose. Not, no accidents happen here. Never. No fail blocks ever. <laughs> Even though probably a decent percentage of the blocks we've placed this episode have been fail blocks. But it doesn't really matter in the long run because we're getting stuff done. Okay. Not really sure. I haven't got into the part of the, like, the building where I do the topping, like, the topper part for the building. But we'll see. Like, I think I didn't do that because we'll see how it looks because it will be already separated from the towers it might give the effect I wanted to get with the other bit also and that's yes, there's no it's in the right spot no I just had to go up one more block <laughs> um oh that's why it looked weird doing it wrong after I just got done talking about how I don't do fail blocks <laughs> uh whatever um, anyway, then we'll put more glass in there. I might actually have to make more glass to fill in all these windows because they're definitely not small windows. That's for sure. Okay. Now we're to the unnecessarily complicated part. Actually, what we could do... Um, I actually did put another torch type thing here. So let's make that quickly. And let's be on the other side before we light ourselves on fire. Okay, how did I do this part? Because the screenshot does not show it. So I shall wing it. I'm fairly sure I didn't do the full, like, fire pit type thing I did over here for that one or this one rather yeah uh, excuse me uh, eating food how did I light on fire? Oh, that, that, that's how I lit on fire yeah water bucket skills <laughs> um anyway I'm actually, I'm, I'll probably have to look at that more closely to make sure I'm doing what I wanted to have done uh, I think that looks right. But what I need to do next is make the second tier on the other side. So, actually I could kind of do that right now. Oh god. I could attempt to do that right now and epically fail. Now how am I going to get back up there? Like this, that's... Turn that back on, jump over the pit of fire, jump up here, and where am I? Well, the window's open so I don't have to jump or ender pearl over there, so... Okay. This is where it gets complicated. Let's make another, well, outline another window here, so one, two, three. That goes there. Then, dirt block, that goes there. Then we have another window going this way. And I am two blocks. I am too high up. 
Well, let's put that there. And break that. Put that there. Drop down here. Put that there and that there. One, two, three, four. Oh. And that goes there. Okay. Progress is being made for this part of it. And now what we need to do is have another bit like that, and then the window will continue out this way as well. Er, actually I don't know how the top tier of windows will turn out for the front part, but yeah, um, hmm. Let's actually test it right now, because the center is... Oh, actually, that works out really well. Because instead of having a three-block wide window, we can just have a four-block one. And I think it will be perfectly centered. Okay. Crisis adverted. Like, that, like no crisis at all. Can you avert a crisis if it was never existent? Hmm. <laughs> well... Uh, anyway, let's, um, I'm going to fill in all these windows, and I will be back after that, and by fill in the windows, I mean make the outlines of the windows, because I'll do all the glass stuff later. Okay, I have the window outlines fail, uh, built, and the next part is going probably to be to make, uh, um, the other half-ish window, actually, I don't know. This w this door is probably going to change where it's at a lot, but what we can do right now would be to stutter what we're sh saying a lot, um, would be to make the win or at least like half of the window here to get the arch up to where it needs to be to make the next part. Um that's not where it goes. Do 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 The window goes back here, I think. And that's the arch, that's the window. Okay, yeah, I believe that is indeed correct, and it looks right, so let's go with it. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, that goes there, then for the center part is hollow, so that goes like, let's just make the entire top part to make it less confusing. So that goes like that, then let's jump back down here build this up to here and make the normal arches because we do build off of the arches on this part. So it is important that we make the arches for this part. Like so. Actually, we need to put the stair there, not like that. Like that. And then... A lever will go there event eventually, but not right now. And we actually need to do that also. Um, okay, progress. I think, maybe. Hard to tell. <laughs> uh, um, so that goes up like that. Then, this part goes up like this, and connects to there. Oh god, I can't tell anything I've actually done. Okay, I can do that. I hope. Goes like that, that, like that. That what I did? Yeah, that looks right. Okay. Wow, stairs. Okay, um, and this is the part where it gets real, really, really messy. Because we make the windowsill things where it goes up to the three stone slabs for each of these ones. 
And they start from there. Actually, um, I'm gonna, yeah, let's just grab levers now, and then we can place the lighting stuff later. Of course, we only have that many levers. We could have made levers up there and saved a jump down. Whatever. And that is way too many levers, but whatever. Let's actually use up all the sticks. That's not how a lever is made. Okay. Let's make our way back up there somehow that I am not seeing an easy way of navigating this mess. Ooh, the interior for this building is gonna be fun. That wasn't sarcastic at all. Oh, that's what I, that's that's what I went down there for, to place the levers. So let's turn those on, that one's on, okay. Let's put a block there. Progress. Uh, we should have also grabbed more stone stuff. Okay, let's work on the entire thing as we go. We're gonna have to have a dirt bit lower to place all the blocks we need to place. I don't know why I took the stone off my bar right there. Oh. And we need more stone bricks. And that works too. <laughs> okay. So we go up like this, and then like that. Then it is windowsill-ish type thing. Same thing over here. Like so. Again, basically the same thing. Well, it is the same thing. Oh, you. Okay. And I have no idea how this, how long this episode's been so far, but I guess the special for 500 subs is longish episode. Because I want to get this entire building done. Then again, after I get this done, I can build a lot of it over there. Then we'll finish up the bottom part. Well, the front part, rather. And yeah, um, I'm not really sure what I would do after that part. Now, what do I do here? I have a general idea, I just don't know the specific block placements I used. Well, actually, do I? Because it's one, two, then it goes under here, where it's wider, then it goes up one. Honestly, I should have just used netherrack for a waste block there, because it's more of a waste block than dirt. Because I will need a lot of it for all the terraforming. I'm gonna break two blocks to break, yeah, break one, because reasons. Now let's place a stone brick there, even though I think it might actually get covered up. Doesn't really matter. Okay. Now let's put the netherrack over here, and let's use the proper waste block now. I don't know why I'm talking like this. I should stop. Uh, okay. I think that's correct. So, let's quickly place blocks because I remember how they go in a real quick like manner. Like so. And over here, I believe. And this is the part where I don't remember what I did. So yeah, um, yeah, I'm going to double check it quickly, because I don't want to build it wrong, because this is the fancy part of the build, not really, but it's something. Okay, good thing I checked, because I was going to do it wrong. Okay, you gotta break that. Stair, 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 another stair. Let's actually put stone bricks behind there. Oh, oh, I got really turned around right there. And stone bricks there and there. And here and there. And to finish up this section, or get close to finishing up this section, stone there just to fill in the extra gaps. Flint and steel. Bye-ya. 
Oh, that's why we brought a second one. Okay. And that is that part. Um, now I'm trying to think of what I... I think I've done all of the planning I've gotten done. I'm going to raise the tower up one more. I'm trapped. Oh, wait, I'm not. Never mind. Uh, tower has to go up. This is going to be slightly different. And let's pick up all this stuff. We're going to have to think of something to do for the doorway. Because I might make, actually, that might work really well. Just make like a half segment of this and have the arch kind of built into the side of that part. That might work really well. That's also an, uh, an even number. Actually, before I cut to finish making all of the, like, repeating designs part, I'm going to go up here so you guys can get better view of what we've done so far. But yeah, I really like how the building separates from the tower there. I think it adds a lot to the building. Uh, I like how much stuff we've put into it, and it's not even half of the building. Like, at all. Yeah, that's going to be a really cool looking front, even at, like, Especially if the towers go up more. Okay, um, I'm going to stop stalling now and make everything I've built on camera in the different areas. Like, finish up the walls, mirror what I've built over here, or what I will be building over here on this side. Then we'll finish it up, and yeah, we'll continue on from there, I guess. Progress has been made. A lot of it. And so many blocks have been placed, it's ridiculous. I actually have to mine in my quarry again fairly soon. Because my stone supply is getting relatively low. I'm actually not sure how much I have. Because of the entire minecart chest thing. Um, anyway, I put in all of the lights, I believe. Unless I missed one or two or a few, I don't really know. And I started to put in all of the windows, but I ran out of gray stained glass. So yeah, I might have to make more. Well, I will have to make more, unless I have glass somewhere else I haven't used yet. I have 12 and I didn't want to start another window. Anyway, I just realized something I missed, which is... The base part to these towers. Um, but the next thing we're gonna work on after I quickly finish this is going to be the um, what's it called? The front part. That's the word. I have no idea why I was unable to think of the word th front. I mean, really, word. Or, li or lack thereof, rather. Um, and another thing I'll have to do sometime is connect there to there. I might have already mentioned that. I don't really know. Because it, it took me a while to build everything else up to the point where that side was. Um, anyway, let's go ahead and start working on this part. As I believe I said earlier, I am going to start building this, but then not build it completely. Actually, it doesn't transition all that well. Like, at all. Eh, actually, it transitions fairly well. Hmm. Or alternatively, I could try and make up a new design. All we have to have is a doorway in the center at about here. One, two, th well, that'd be three now. Four, five, six, seven. I said seven, very weird right there. I don't care. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Up oh, there goes Skype. Okay. It's looking like we might actually be able to make both 
windows. At the same time, it's an even number, so the bit in between it would end up being a little bit odd. Okay, what do I want to do for this part? Um, let's take that down. Let's put that there. Let's take that down and put this there, so we can at least have a window still. Jump up, put that there. Not sure if that should actually go there or not. Uh, yeah. Oh my god, that was that was something else. Um. Yeah, we could have like little side windows there, and then to fill in this area, we could do like a cross beam coming off of there to there. Then the meeting up at like an angle type thing there. Yeah, that that seems good to me. I think should be interesting to see how it all comes together, though. But it's not like we've never winged anything in the past, and it turned out good anyway. Okay, so windows there ish. Always have to remember the ish. Nothing is final. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and make these windows and then we can always like take bits off of them later. Yeah, I think that would probably be the best course of action given the scenario. No oh, good. I cannot reach that. Now I can open that does not go there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Blocks. Okay, does that look ridiculous? It looks like a- oh my god, it looks like a face. Uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna have to change that. As fun as it is, we can't have it looking like a face. Well, we can, but I don't feel like having it. Um, okay. How do I want to do this part? That's definitely gonna be the arch. Now we just have to figure out what to do with the arch. Actually, let's work from the bottom up for this. I think that might go the best. Okay. Oh, that is not where I wanted that to go. One, two, three, four, five. Um, let's just fill this entire area in with, well not the entire area, but this part in with stone. And now that's way too tall of a window, and we need some type of decorative base for it. And I vote on something along the lines of what we did on the other side, only not quite. Like that looks fairly good. Eh, I could actually probably use a little bit more. Yeah, I would say that looks good. Then the doors will open outward for defensive purposes. I think that makes sense. Okay. Then. Hmm. Should we do that? Then. Well, how large of a window is this? One, two, three, four, five. That's five. Ooh, that's another thing. Um, could actually probably get away with this. Put that there. We need the window sill. Well, we don't need it, but I'm gonna make it anyway because reasons. I've said I've said because reasons a lot this episode. I'm not really sure why. Then this will also add a nice arch type dealio to this part. Um, ooh. What did a five tall arch look like again? Oh, weird. That's not where that goes. One, two, three, four, five with that. 
Um, I think a four tall arch might actually be the best option here. And it shouldn't matter all that much that's a even number because it's vertical, not horizontal. And I mean, it's already even numbers the other way. I think that's actually five. One, two, three. Well, that's six. Oh, I meant six. I don't know why I said four. Maybe because it's an even number. <laughs> okay, let's tear this down so we can make more other shapes. Uh, wait, what? Oh, derp. Okay, let me move. Okay, let's hop back up here and put that bit there, which will go down into something there, which will go into that, which that doesn't really work. That works quite well, though. I like that. Me gusta, which is I like in Spanish. I really gotta stop talking in Spanish. That class is rubbing off on me too much. Oh, I need more food also soon. Uh, problems. Okay. Well, let's take down this dirt pillar. Oh, and temporary floor vanishes in a blink of an eye. Okay. That goes there. Yeah. That goes there. And I did include that part. Like that, break that, and then that. Is that right? I think it is. Well, not really right, but in comparison to this other part. Okay progress is being made. It still looks like a face, but once we put like beams and stuff going over that part, I think it will be fixed. Let's actually put this part in over here and fill in the window, which is about like this, give or take. A few blocks on either side and one up here. Okay. Let's fill in this part also. I can't quite reach it without dirt. So we shall use some dirt. Break all the dirt. And grass, apparently. Okay, now what do I want to do for this part? Fall, that's what. Okay. I think it might be easier if we construct the top part first for this segment, at least. So we'll jump up. One, two, three, four. That goes like that. Then that's not going to work. There we go. Oh, how did that happen? Must have let go of shift. I have two under pearls left. I am not prepared for this. Okay, break that, and that, or replace that rather, and that there. Do I want to make another fire pit torch type thing under the main one? I'm gonna say no, because it's extra, it's wider than the rest of them, and yeah. Um, actually I think we might want to do the window bit slightly different for this one. And eh, not like that though. Eh, we need dirt. Especially because our ender pearls are all breaking. Um, that's not what I wanted to do. Eh. Uh, hmm, nah, I don't really like that all that much. So, 
yeah, I guess let's stick with that. Maybe that? Mm, I don't know. Okay, now I need to fill in this entire center part with something, preferably. If I'm not gonna do the entire torch thing, that kinda complicates this on what I could put here. Um, yeah, I'm gonna figure something out off camera because it's gonna take a lot of trial and error. So yeah, I'll be back once I have something built here. Okay, I got something built for the front part. Um, I'm not completely sold on it yet, but I think it still looks good regardless. Like, it's a lot of very odd shapes. And, yeah. Um, it's also hard to tell what it would actually look like with the interior. One, like, once that's in. Because that would probably give it a completely different feel also. Um, anyway... Let's go up here. Wow, we actually made that. Wow. I was not expecting that, honestly. <laughs> um, anyway. Hmm. What do I want to do for this window? I mean, it's, it's not all that much larger than any other window here, so... Let's just make it the standard size. Because it's literally just one block wider. Then again, that's a eh, that's a decent amount wider in com like relative to its complete size, though. Okay, but I would say that we can like actually fill in the entire window bit now that it's two blocks wider, or one block wider, that is. So let's put stuff there. Eh, eh, gimme, no. Like so, and then we'll put a window in there for that part. Okay, um, I don't know where to go. Where do I go? Yeah. So much stuff. It's, it's kind of ridiculous. Okay, I think we're actually getting fairly close to finishing the exterior. Um, we need to do a topper to the tower and a topper to the this part. But I would say that this episode's probably getting a bit too long, per se. So I think we'll do one more thing then finish it up after that, and, um, where did I put the flint and steel? Actually, I'm not sure. I'm trying to think of what I could do for the roof, because I'm not, like, do I want to just have a fairly open rooftop, kind of like what I do for all the castle tops, where it's, like, just buttresses or something similar and then a flat roof or do I want to make like a normal triangle roof on top of it the thing about that would be it would be hard to include this little front part in that then again I could just make the top of this a balcony I would have to do another layer or some sort of trim to hide all of the levers um, I would say that this is a good place to end it, because, like, I want your guys' input for this. Um, what type of roof should I make for it? A flat-topped roof or a, like, pointed roof that would go like that? That was not the correct, like, mo- That would have not been the correct angles and whatnot, but, yeah, whatever. And what I think I'm going to do for the tops of the towers is, because they're not really defensive, I think I'm going to just make, like, a torch or something on top of them. But this building definitely is turning out really good. Like, really, really good. Now I'm trying to find somewhere for me to take a screenshot for the thumbnail. And we did not make the jump. And we failed the enderpearl.
<laughs> okay. So yeah, um, let me let me know what you guys like think I should do for the roof, and if you have any other ideas like about this, I would be glad to hear them also. Um, yeah, that's it for this episode, I guess. Again, thanks for subscribing and sticking around. It's crazy that there's 500 of you guys who like subscribed to me. Well, 503 now as of recording this. Actually, went up one. So yay. Um. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this unusually long episode. Then again, it's not. It's probably at like 50 to 50 minutes to an hour by now. But yeah, not sold on this front part yet, though. I don't know. Hmm. Anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, which I hope you did, feel free to leave a like. And also, another reminder, look forward to the SMP episode coming up where I'll talk about the server contest to get on the server. And yeah, if you... I almost said that again. Um, anyway, I'll see you guys next episode. Bye.